we're here back in our studio live with the Naughty Train Cats. How you guys doing tonight? Good, doing okay, dude. Doing pretty good. Great. We're happy to have you guys here. We're happy to be here. Definitely. Mostly. Uh, sort of. Well, not me. First up, uh, I think the audience wants to know how you guys met and got together as a band. We met. We met back in. Um, uh, it was been. It was about 2004. 2004. Yeah. Yeah. In 2004. Where was it at? That we met. I don't remember. It's been so long. Some place where there's like a, a bar and stuff. Yeah. yeah. It's, yeah it's a bunch of people. Yeah, that sounds right. Yeah, that sounds about right, yeah. So I know when I was growing up, I was really into the Metallica and the Megadeth and the Slayer, and they really had a big influence on my life. What are some of the musical influences that affected this band and caused you to come up with a sound that you're putting out today? Yeah, I mean, that's about all the Yeah, I'd say mostly I'm just under the influence, so I don't really know anybody. Like, that I would follow or anything. So I don't, yeah. Just me? I meant my own influence. What about you? Uh, I'm the same, same as him. I follow myself. We don't really listen to anybody, you know? We don't, like, no. follow trends or listen to other bands and be like, oh, they're awesome because we're the, we're the real deal, man. We're the Naughty Train Cats. We pay, make our own path. Yeah. So, you guys have a hit single, heavy metal, honor student, that went to the top of the charts. How are you guys dealing with the success of having a hit single and being out there on the road? I think success is inevitable, you know. Uh, from the moment we played one note, uh, people were just going crazy. So, uh, dealing with success, uh, I don't even really know what that word means. I don't care. Success. I don't I don't really know. Do you know what it means? I know we were born. We were born, man, to be number one. It's exciting. I guess success is being number one, man. I guess that's us. Do you guys have a new album coming out soon? What's the name of the album? And how did you come up with the name for the album? I think your viewers would like to know the name of the album. Damn, I don't even remember the name of the album. It's the long track home. The long long track home. Okay. Yeah, we're the naughty train cats. Yeah, so it's like a track, you know, on, on with a train. It's like going on a track, and I've never been on a train before. Have you? Not seen a train. But I have a, my aunt has a cat, so I don't know what that has to do with. Hey, this guy's naughty. Yeah. This guy's naughty, man. I'm naughty. So. What so was the question again? No. The name of the album. Yeah, yeah. name of the album. Long track home. So we've heard some rumors about you guys getting ready to gear up and go on tour. And I think the fans want to know, when can we catch you guys on tour? You can catch us on, you can catch us on tour. They, they can find out all the tour dates on, uh, on our uh, yeah, it's MySpace my slash my Naughty Train Cats. Yeah. And Facebook slash Naughty Train Cats. And uh, we also have a Friendster account, I think. Or, um, Do we still have that? I don't know, we have like an email and a web address. Uh, I don't know what that is. Uh, I don't know. Email. But we're on tour. We're playing uh, Chicago, LA, Sacramento, uh, and then we go to London. I just go with you guys, man. Yeah, I don't even think those are our real tour days. I just kind of made those up. But uh, we do are playing some shows and stuff, so yeah, they should definitely check us out. Just um, type in our name on the in the web thing. Yeah. That should be good. So now we get to the part of the show where I like to play a little game that is called word association. I'm gonna give you guys a word and you tell me the first thing that comes into your mind. Money. Uh, money. Money. No. 
Dude. Dude, he's asleep. Or passed out or something. I'll answer for him. Money, we has it. Lots of it. Fame. Fame. Temporary. A lot of people don't know that fame is short for the word fame of us. Famous. It's abbreviated. Go ahead. Fame. Uh. Fame. You can what? catch us on. Um, you can catch us on tour. They, they can find out all the time. Alright, so we got you guys action figures here on the set. Um, very interesting. Um, famous so soon and action figures out so soon. Very interesting. Want you guys to tell me about these and who came up with them and how they came about. Alright dude, these are some of the dolls here that's been made by Hasbro and it's actually pretty cool. It's the first time I've seen them. You know? <clears throat> um, here's the C-Rex doll. Cool. Got like a bicep. It's got the guitar. And got this chick on the side here. Um, well, if anybody wants to buy them, C-Rex doll's cool. You know, buy the C-Rex doll. Forget about this doll right here. But, like I said, you know, if you want to purchase one, just go online. I know the uh, Naughty Train Cats. Dot com and just buy you one, man. Dude, they're awesome. Look, see Rex, man. We all got, also got distribution in like Walmart and uh, places like this. So, yeah, I mean, these are awesome looking dolls. I'm the greatest stage. guitar player ever. I'm Bobby Trouble. Damn. Why did mine come with this stuff, man? <laughs> you didn't, man. It just comes in a package. What? There's also a set you can buy, like, all three. How did all this stuff get on me, man? Dude, you've been drinking, like, all drunk, night. Man. All night. You've been sitting here. Stupid question. Rock and roll, man.